Good evening. Tonight, during the preparation, uh, we will be drinking San Miguel. And it's the only cold, well, I've got me raspberry jam donut, but we're not having that at the minute. So, tonight, extravaganza is a chicken tagine with preserved lemons and olives. And we will be using chicken thighs. Now, these are with bone and skin on. Um, when you kind of eat it, you've got to strip all that off. So sometimes I'll make it with fillet buns with no skin on. And tonight we've got a whole menu. So, um, start off with, we're going to make it in a tagine. There you go, got one here. Uh, notice the lovely pink. No, I'm matching tonight. Um, this is a little bit of a bugger, this one, because it's not the easiest thing to get the lid off. All right? They get a little ridgy, but they don't really out much. And when this thing's hot, you end up using a cloth. So I'm biding my time before I drop the bloody thing and break it. But we don't need the lid yet. Okay, so we've got a nice dish here, and we do all the cooking in here and the whole thing together in here. Now, I usually, when I start, use the back ring, the big one, but when we do the going cooking, that it just like whoo, bubbles away and it makes a right and bloody mess. So we'll probably just stick with the small ring anyway, okay? So, what we're going to need to start off with, oh, didn't get them out, but I've got them out, um, some onions. We're going to add three onions, okay, three chopped onions. Uh, we're going to have garlic, um, we're going to add ground ginger, some ground cumin seeds, I'm going to grind that up, I'll show you how I'm doing that in a minute. Uh, some ground peppercorns and um, obviously the preserved lemons, okay. Now the very first time I did this, couldn't get old preserved lemons and I thought, What's wrong with using lemons? They're bloody lemons, aren't they? No, you don't want to use fresh lemons. It's too sharp and horrible. These, these aren't like that. Okay. I can't remember where I bought them. But you can buy them in the supermarkets. I think I, think I ordered them from the Asian cook shop. But I normally just get them up the supermarket. I don't always have them. Uh, we're going to be using a shed load of saffron again. So a bit expensive, this one. No. Excuse me, bloody gassy beer for you, innit? So, I'm going to start off by preparing the onions. I'll get them chopped up and then I'll come back to you when we get to the next bit. 